multiplying fractions by whole numbers. Max, Amy, Eva, Otto, and Zoe are organizing a picnic. Amy is in charge of preparing the sandwiches. If she wants to make two sandwiches for each person, and there are five people in total, how many sandwiches does she have to make? Very good! We can also see the multiplication problem as a repeated addition problem. 2 multiplied by 5 is the same as 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 2. How many sandwiches does she have to make? Zoe thinks that two sandwiches each is too much food, and it would be better to make half a sandwich for each person. Just like before, we can see the multiplication problem as a repeated addition problem. Do you remember how to add fractions with the same denominator? Don't worry, I'll remind you. When the denominators are the same, we put the denominator in the result and add the numerators. Think about this. How else can we write such a long repeated addition problem? Great! To multiply a fraction by a whole number, all we need to do is multiply the numerator by the whole number and keep the denominator the same. Let's look at another example. Otto is in charge of the dessert. He wants to make five cakes, one for each person. If he needs three quarters of a bag of flour to make each cake, how much flour does he need in total? Very good! To find the result, we just have to multiply the numerator by the whole number and keep the denominator the same. Now you know how to multiply fractions by whole numbers. Keep practicing!